Welcome back, everybody. Yeah, this is a big truck we're talking about outside uh, in front of our building. Uh, we're going to find out more about it in just a second, but I want to tell you about Touch a Truck, which is coming up this weekend, Sunday, as a matter of fact, from 10 till 3 at uh, Lincoln Field Shopping Center. Uh, Melody Parabacci is here from Mothercraft Ottawa. How are you? Very well, thank you. Good to see you. you. And this is a guy that operates a truck. He works for the city of Ottawa. Chris Millett is here. Chris, how are you? Good, thanks. Welcome to the program. Thank you. First of all, tell me about this truck. This is one of those trucks that does just about everything, right? Just about everything. Okay. Uh, what does it do? Basically, it plows the snow. It's a combo unit. Again, it's got the front plow, the, the side plow. Yeah. It also, uh, in the back, it has the anti-icing uh, for the to prevent the pack on. Oh, yeah? Makes the assault actuate a little bit faster. Yeah. And, and you, uh, you, you, it applies you, abrasives. Really? You've operated this truck? Yes, sir. How long have you been doing that? Eight years. Is that right? Yeah. Is it fun? Oh, very fun. Yeah? It's a big toy. I suppose, eh? It's a big yes. toy. Now, the beauty of this uh, Touch a Truck event is young people and all people actually get all a chance people. to come have a look at this thing and uh, others like it, correct? Absolutely. Yes, there's all kinds of wonderful vehicles at Touch a Truck and it is for young and old. As a matter of fact, sometimes I think that some of the, some of the parents that come are even as excited or yeah. even a little more excited than the children <laughs> that get to come. It's uh, great because they get to not only walk around and see the vehicles, but they get to hop inside, check things out from the inside. We've got all kinds of things there. We have a crane, we have a tractor, a front end loader, the oh, yeah. Zamboni, yeah. We, you name it, and it's there. Fire trucks, police cars, yeah. everything. Well, now what truck do you want to see when you go? I mean, obviously you know this one. <laughs> Right? I like the grader personally. Yeah, oh, the grader, that's cool. Eh? Oh, yeah. Have you ever operated one of those? Yeah. Have you? Yes, sir. That's going to be cool too. Because we all did that when we were kids, right? Yeah, with In the, the backyard with a, with a piece of wood or whatever, and then we'd make the grader do the thing and make roads, right? Absolutely. And that's what this is really all about. It's a, you know, a little bit of childhood uh, coming back to us. It is, absolutely. Yeah. And on top of all the vehicles, we also have a lot of other types of entertainment going on. We have musical entertainment, we have Little Ray's reptiles coming out, oh. face painting, a little magic, some balloon crafts, all kinds of fun and games. Yeah, it's all happening at uh, Lincoln Fields. Lincoln Fields. Now, it's tell Sunday. me about Mothercraft because this is the, obviously the beneficiary of this event, right? Absolutely. So Mothercraft Ottawa is a non-profit, multifaceted, family-focused agency uh -huh. and we provide services and programs for families uh, right from pregnancy through to school age. And so the, the proceeds from this event are going to support the vulnerable, vulnerable families that we support in the community, so right. including the Birth and Parent Companion Program, where we train volunteers as doulas to work with vulnerable women through the birthing process and the transition into early parenting. Gotcha. It's a wonderful uh, organization, and you do a lot of fine work in the city. Thank I you know so much. we've, uh, you know, the Elvis Sighting Society has donated to you before, and, and with good reason. Uh, how much, uh, how much rope you got on that camera there, Zach? Zach's just back from Mexico. He's a little. <laughs> uh, can we get to the other side? Do you think? Uh, if we go around front, can we go around front We're and have in. a look? Chris, so, so this is the side plow, obviously. Yes, sir. And this drops down. It's huge, eh? Yeah. Right? you you got a lot of moving parts in this thing. It's a big responsibility. I yeah. know it's fun for you, but... Yeah, it's a lot to handle. And, yeah, uh, yeah. you got to multitask a lot, and you got to be aware of all, the, all situations, but... Look at the size of this plow on the front here. Yeah. That it's... thing's huge. Yeah, a lot of snow. Yeah. Oh, oh. Uh, hang on. There, traffic. Traffic. So... And this is, uh, what's, what's in the orange part here? What that's goes a, in there? That's a freeze fighter tank. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Excellent. Man, oh man. And this is how you Jump get up in. in there? Yeah. All right. Holy moly. Look at all the gadgets and things you gotta, you gotta operate in here, man. Yeah, go on and sit down and all go right. on. Thanks. <laughs> the keys are in it. I'm scared. Wow. There you go, eh? Holy smokes, man. Yes, I die. No wonder people want to climb up in these things and have a look. They're fantastic. Isn't that cool? The kids should love it. Now, how much training do you go through to learn to operate one of these? Quite a bit. Yeah, I bet, eh? Yeah. Yeah. So you move up when you work with uh, the city and, and, and do different things and eventually you get to here? Yeah, exactly. This is cool. But uh, you just got to multitask a lot and uh, yeah. just be aware of your surroundings and yeah, go yeah. from there. Listen, man, thanks for bringing the truck down. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. You'll see this truck and others uh, this Sunday uh, at Lincoln Fields. What time again? 10 till 3. Melody, thanks for coming by. Thank you so much. Touch a truck this weekend for Mothercraft. Enjoy it.